last good yeti lived under my bed. He moved in when I was four and called himself Fred. Hey, I'm Fred. He stepped all day. And played all night. Jump, 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 jump. Oh, ow. Fred down. He'd take all the covers and wrap himself tight. Snuggy. He jumped on the bed and moved it all around. Hey, look at me. Look at me. I'm upside down. My mom would uh, shout uh, in. Will you please keep it oh. down? Shh, be quiet. Sorry. He only ate bananas dipped in goat cheese. Um. Then he'd wash it all down with a big bucket of tea. Excuse me. You pig! He liked to take a bath at least twice a week. Bubbles! I love bubbles. He used my dad's fishing line to wash his big teeth. He liked when I put a lot of mousse in his hair. He liked it all spiked with bows everywhere. Fred pretty. He enjoyed taking my cover and wearing it as a toga while doing this routine of stretching and yoga. Ouch, Fred down again. Now that I'm eight, Fred has moved next door. He lives under my sister's bed. She just turned four.